Okay, so it was revealed now that Takashi 69 has a snitch, an informant in the case, okay? And a lot of people are saying it's Billy Otto because he fell out with Shadi and 6ix9ine just a few months ago, okay? Actually, more than that, six months ago, I'd say. Well, he reacts to all this. Now, also, uh, we got, you know, they're very concerned about this. You know, Takashi's lawyer is very concerned about this, but they still feel like he might make bail this week. Uh, Shadi, uh, you know, was kind of a loose cannon in court the other day, saying it's Treyway, we never fall, we stick together, all that stuff. And uh, then also, uh, you know, we'll have to see what happens with that. But Shadi is definitely a liability in this case for 6 9 Now, Billy Otto says that the informant has to be somebody that was around the whole time during those incidences. He says he wasn't around that time, and he seems pretty stand-up loyal guy to me whenever he preaches everything. He stands on morals and principles, so I don't think he would uh, ever snitch. Now, Shadi tried to do an interview with academics, allegedly, according to him. He denied it, which is good, because, you know, he shouldn't, academics should kind of stay clear of everything now, since it's now a crazy case. Uh, you know, it's a Fed case. Anyways, Let's get into this. Jordan Tower, JT News, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Okay, so Billy Otto, this was his reaction to people saying he is an informant. He's the informant. A lot of fans are speculating. Yo, is you people retarded or, or slow? All you gotta do, right? Read everything these niggas are charged with, read the indictment. Read the dates. Read what they're charged with. So obviously, if it was somebody in the group telling about anything that they're charged with, it had to be somebody around them at that time, right? Around all the crimes that they're charged with, right? Think about it. Use your fucking head, you idiots. If they're being charged with mad shit, and somebody's telling about all them shits that they're being charged with, nothing else but what they're being charged with, it had to be around somebody that was around them at that time. Fuck somebody that's not around them at that time could tell them if they charged with stuff. Think about it, son. Yo, is you people retarded or, or slow? All you gotta do, right? Read everything these niggas are charged with. Read the indictment. Read the dates. Read what they're charged with. So obviously, if it was somebody in the group telling about anything that they're charged with, it had to be somebody around them at that time, right? Around all the crimes that they're charged with, right? Think about it. Use your fucking head, you idiots. If they're being charged with mad shit, if somebody's telling about all them shits that they're being charged with, nothing else but what they're being charged with, it had to be around somebody that was around them at that time. So, you know, he makes a good point here, and you guys should probably leave him alone because I don't think he would be the one to do that. And he wouldn't be just on the internet doing that. They probably have this guy in protective custody at this point since they know it's a high situation with, you know, with all the phone calls they intercepted where Takashi was in danger. Anyways, guys. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Hit that thumbs up button, guys. I appreciate you guys. And hit that subscribe button. I'll go live in a little bit and we'll discuss the album.